Hello Taurus, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your messages from Spirit Reading. It will be for April 2021 for the sign of Taurus. So let's get straight into your reading Taurus and pull your overarching energy or message for the month. Message for Taurus please. And remember these are just messages, they won't resonate with everybody so just take what resonates with you. What do we have for Taurus please? Okay, first card, Taurus, we have admit your vulnerabilities. Sometimes this is seeing vulnerabilities not as a weakness, but as something to embrace, to divine who, define who you are, even facing them. Message for Taurus, please. Okay, that turned over very quickly. We have dream talk. Your subconscious constantly and subtly speaks through your dreams is just one of the many ways in which your soul and those here in the spirit world can reach out and communicate with you through signs symbols messages and more there's definitely something here i mean obviously this can be about communication to dreams but there's also something to do with the subconscious energy as well things coming to the surface to be released maybe taurus Let's see what else we get. What do we have for Taurus, please? Angels, spirits, guides, message for our lovely Taurians. Thank you. Yeah, it, it definitely is. Oh my goodness. You know, your energies are very in sync. We have number 21, illuminate the shadow. Interesting. Uh, focus on a solution. But that illuminate the shadow energy. Again, some of you, there could be dealing with some subconscious energy you know and our subconscious releases things from the past sometime you know uh, that come into our conscious reality so that they can finally be dealt with faced and released so again there's definitely something to do with focusing on a solution but this shadow energy it feels yeah it feels facing releasing something I'm going to pull one more card and then we'll go into the tarot cards message for taurus please message for taurus okay final card yeah we have raven prepare for change archangels azriel and bokpi so prepare for change i'm going to pull three cards taurus Okay, what do we have for our lovely Taurians? Thank you. Message for Taurus. April 2021. What is the message from Spirit, please? First card out. So we have the Four of Cups. Queen of Cups. Generally Cancer for me as a reader, male or female energy, though it's not limited to a person, obviously. And the Moon. Oh my goodness. Now this is subconscious energy, it's also dream energy too. Um, Knight of Swords. Okay. I'm going to clarify this Queen of Cups. Let's clarify this Queen of Cups, please. So it feels in this energy that you're being offered something. Let's clarify this Queen of Cups, please. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, you are. <laughs> You are being offered something, the Knight of Cups. Yeah, I mean, I felt that energy quite strongly. But you, you don't know whether you want it, what's holding you back. Four of Cups, you know, is, it feels like you're being given some kind of divine nudge here. Uh, there's an opportunity that you're being offered and it feels male or female energy with this Queen of Cups, but it's to do with the heart energy, something to do with love. It feels to do with love, romance, relationships.
And the, the Knights bring change. So again, this prepare for change. But this energy of admitting your vulnerabilities is, is quite strong here, Taurus. It feels something is, is either holding you back or and it, it feels, I was feeling this subconscious energy very, very clearly. Something from the past that needs to be released. Because it's almost kind of like it's stunting the growth in what you're being offered here. You know, there's an energy of you're being offered something here, but crossed arms, crossed legs, you don't know whether you want it. You're giving deep thought to a situation, but there's no progress here right now. And it's to do with something to do with a, either someone's expressing their feelings for you or offering you love. Somebody who's very clear on what they want, that's for sure. And it brings positive change. It brings uplifting, positive energy. But there's a feeling here, Taurus. There's lack of clarity. You have lack of clarity. The moon energy. This is fear. This is fear. This is uncertainty. This is... I can't predict what's what the outcome's going to be, so I don't know whether to go for it. <laughs> it is that kind of energy. I don't really know how this is going to pan out long term, so um, I can't predict if it's going to be a success or failure. And because it's to do with my emotions and feelings, and you know, I've been hurt before. I don't know whether this is for me right now. I don't know if I'm ready. It's when our emotions can keep us really stuck. And there's a message here with the moon. Something in your subconscious needs to be released. It feels like there's some kind of block. And that's definitely the energy that I'm getting. This is intuitive energy as well, the moon energy. You know, your intuition is definitely telling you to consider this offer from somebody here. But it's almost kind of like the fear is blocking it. The fear, the doubt, the uncertainty, the lack that you can't predict everything that's going to happen, the end result. Bottom of the deck, you know, the Knight of Swords can be a conversation, communication, can bring clarity. Uh, this is also a card of getting clarity, finding direction, uh, fi you know, getting your head around something, going for something, it feels. Uh, it feels going for it. It feels there's progress when you get clarity. can be to do with some conversation, communication that you might have. The message is to speak. I think it's to communicate your fears with this person. I'm definitely getting this energy of bring it out into the open, you know? Bring it out into the open. Whatever your reservations are, the clarity comes from, and the change comes from bringing it out into the open and facing those vulnerabilities and communicating those vulnerabilities because it's almost kind of like you're this person's offering you love romance relationship male or female energy but they don't have clarity on how you feel right now and there's definitely an energy of you need to bring this out into the open because that's how you find the solution you light the shadow you sh you shine the light in the shadow Yeah, and that's what Spirit is telling you here. Bring it out into the open. And that's, that's how you find the solution. I feel very, it feels very clear here, Taurus. There's definitely some kind of reservation that you have. And it's to do with some kind of deep, intrinsic, hidden fear. That you might not be fully aware of yourself. You know? Um, because it's your subconscious energy. So, you know, past experiences can shape us and they can leave imprints, whether we're fully aware of it in our conscious reality or not. And there's definitely this energy of something has left an imprint on you from the past. And it's about facing it, owning it, shining a light on it, talking it, bringing it out into the open. And that's the only way that you're going to make progress in this situation. But it definitely feels there's something very beautiful coming to you. 
you know, we've got Knight of Cups is Pisces, um, Queen of Cups is Cancer. Obviously, this is to do with the heart energy as well. So, you know, might not just be to do with those signs. We've got Gemini here as well. You know, one or a number of those signs might mean something to you in April too. But it feels very hopeful. It just, th I feel that something needs to be brought out into the open because that's how you find the way forward. Wow. Okay. Final message for Taurus. Yeah, we have changes can bring you new life and energy. We will hold your hand. Number 25. You're being guided. You see what they're offering. The cup that they're offering here, this person, you know, you're being guided, nudged towards it by spirit. You know, it definitely feels like you're being given some kind of help there. Um, hidden blessings as well with the moon energy. But it definitely feels in this situation, something needs to be brought out into the open. So I hope you enjoyed the reading. Taurus, if you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful month for you all and I will see you next time. Thank you.